Hi, well it's day 125 um, and I've had a really good day today actually. I was, you know, I left I left my house for work at about maybe half past seven this morning and I got back at maybe half past six at night but in between you know, I mean, when I first left this morning, I was really scared because I've had, to, you know, because I've had some issues going on at work and um, I've been called into a meeting to discuss, you know, my sick absence and stuff like that. And I was quite shocked when I got the letter. It was quite scary. But... It was sort of like it was so, but deep down, I think I had the confidence to be able to deal with it. And today, I actually showed that I that I could deal with it. So that's what I was talking about when I was talking about battles, you know. Um, and okay, you know, it was very official quite scary I had, I had company with me you know that came in and supported me you know I had I had a union rep by my side and I'm an ex and I'm an ex union rep myself so you know we both kind of were a bit of a formidable force and he helped calm me down you know because when you go into these kinds of meetings to talk about you know attendance management or whatever um, or sickness absence or whatever it is they're quite scary because the wording is very to the point it's very punchy and very sharp and very matter of fact sorry I've just had a sub and um, a foot long one as well yeah murder on your teeth sometimes but yeah, anyway, um, it was it was quite scary. But I had I had quite a long chat with my with my representative, who didn't really have to say much on my behalf because he he calmed me right down. Because I remember coming in and I was kind of. I was petrified because I was I was scared to death of what might happen but I thought I'll keep myself calm I'll keep myself composed and I'll do what I can do and that's it so that is what that is what I did you know he just basically told me you know you've got to think about what you're going to say and how you're going to say it and how you're going to come across and remember that there are certain things that they're not going to want to listen to. So you just kind of have to gauge it yourself and see what happens. And you know what? It was absolutely fine. You know, I totally, I totally smashed it. You know, I, I went in there preparing for the worst. You know, that was going to get a written warning, but it didn't happen. It didn't happen because I, I put forward an argument that they couldn't contend you know they couldn't contest with it so it was quite um, it was quite good for me uh, in a nutshell I feel like I've got my balls back you know to coin a phrase I know that's a bit crass but it's probably true you know I think I feel like I've got a lot of my confidence and my balls back and I'm glad because I never thought that it would happen like this, but I just I just held my nerve and I stayed strong and stood my ground and I said I said what I needed to say, not too much, not too little, and you know I uh, I won so. That's great for me. I was virtually skipping to the bus stop on the way home. 
you know, which is great for me because I haven't felt that way in a long time. Genuinely not felt that way in a long time. So yeah, I'm uh, I'm pretty good right now. I'm really good in fact. You know, I just fancy sort of just being nice and chilled for a while, you know, just kind of sitting, because this is what, whenever I achieve something major like this and my confidence gets a major boost, what I tend to do is once it's over, either a few hours later or maybe the next morning, um, I tend to sort of spend time in in silence and just kind of soak it up, you know, I, I don't really feel like I should brag because that's not fair and I mean I I know that my manager didn't want to have to do it I could tell that she was in a difficult position and I could she could see that I was in a difficult position but we we kept it civil and the weird thing is, even though I've had issues with her in the past, I still actually genuinely quite like her. I think she's funny. I think she's funny. I think she I think she does care about people. And um I got the right result, the result that I want that I wanted and I've just got to do this one. I've just got one more left to go. Because I've actually got two meetings that I need to I've had two meetings to prepare for so I'm going to see what happens and we'll take it from there so yeah it's all good anyway I've had a great day I hope you have too and uh, I'll see you later okay bye bye